Okay, introduce yourself. I'm Ken Chorley with Evolve Ministries. All right. Now, Ken has come down here um, from Michigan, and he came down here to do some hands-on training, face-to-face -face work. What were your initial expectations when you came down? I left myself kind of open. Uh, I really didn't have any expectations. You know, I had been doing a lot of seeking online over the last few months, and had some powerful experiences on my own in meditation, and um, definitely had the sense that uh, there were some things I could learn, but I wanted to leave myself open to any scenario and anything that would happen, and not really expect too much or too less. Perfect. So um, now that you've gotten a chance, because you've had some enriching experiences down here, that is for sure. <laughs> <laughs> the wind here is going completely nuts. He's had some enriching experiences, things that usually when I teach other people that doesn't really get to happen because certain things are set up to where they don't. But in this particular case, I guess he needed these experiences and they were very deep, deep, <laughs> deep experiences. So now that you've gotten to see uh, partially of what we do down here, um, there's a thing that's most students and most teachers out there when it comes to energy they're really tapping into to just the ambient potential potential of their environment and so the thing is is now that you've seen what an engineered environment looks like next to just an ambient environment where you're learning how to just pull in from your surroundings what would you say is the difference of knowledge a uh, vast difference of knowledge i mean there's a huge difference in it i mean when you can engineer it's so much easier to connect with everything when you're out in the ambient. It's like you have to build up, you know, you have to take a hot spot or a certain area and then build and send energy. But when you can actually create the environment, everything is way more interactive, it's easier. I mean, just coming here on my first day and getting to be in a built environment, it was, you know, it was a lot easier, but it's so much more knowledge to get to that point. You That's have right. To have, you have to have the tools to get you to be able to engineer. Exactly. No one has to come here and be able to work in an engineered environment is amazing. I can't express it enough. It is life changing and amazing. The knowledge and the learning from Evolved Ministries is beyond anything I've seen. Beautiful. Um, now we know you're going to be coming back. How how. Uh, Important, by the way, and before we go any further, how important do you think learning the ego is when it comes for for a self mastery practitioner? How important is it to learn about the ego? It would be the most important lesson, the first lesson, the most important thing that you must learn is to how to break down the ego and to look with inside and master yourself. You have to go inside. I mean. You know, we have all these things that are like layers of an onion that cover us up and all these inner Perfect. issues and childhood things that we haven't dealt with. And until we deal with those things, you know, this is going to cause problems if you don't deal with that. If you get into this and start moving towards this, you will have issues, major issues, if you do not work on your ego. So the ego is the number one thing. The thing I would say beyond anything you want to do, if you have any, you know, desire to do this, you need to first look at yourself and first examine the things in your life that you need to work through and focus on those things as long as it takes because it's worth the time. Like that has to be changed. You have to work on that and understand it 100%. Understand the ego. Absolutely amazing. So, um, Ken, we're going to be looking forward to seeing you a lot more. Um, Ken's actually going to be on the site as well. We have the Evolved Ministry site coming, uh, www.evolvedministry.com. And um, come there, learn. You will be amazed. And the fact of the matter is we've got so many things to offer that <laughs> you'll definitely be able to keep yourself entertained there no matter what. Anyway, much love to all. Thank you, Ken, for your time. Thank you. Much gratitude. Evolved Ministry, out.